Hey, it's Frankie Cola. In this video, I want to talk to you about when your long-term girlfriend breaks up with you. Your long-term girlfriend of six years broke up with you suddenly and you are left confused. One moment you are angry, another you feel overwhelmed with pain. Now it's hard to comprehend why a girl who professed her love for you just a few months ago suddenly has gone cold. If you want to know the psychological dynamics of why this happens, you'll want to pay close attention to this video. You will learn why the fact that you were in a long-term relationship doesn't matter, why she acts cold and distant right now and doesn't love you anymore, even though she was crazy in love with you in the past, and how to fix it, sneaky relationship mistakes you should be eliminating from your habits because they ruin attraction, and how to get her attraction back. Okay now, let's go over a question from our good friend Bob, who's going through this situation as well. My girlfriend of six years just broke up with me about a month ago. I'm still devastated. We had six years of deep love. She's now seeing a new guy she just met while completely ignoring me. What I don't get is how she can suddenly act this way when she was crazy in love with me. A year ago, she said she loved me. She said she couldn't imagine being with anyone else. We would talk about our future together. We'd fantasize about getting married, having kids, the house we'd live in. It was deep love. I mean, there has to be some love left in her. After those six years and all that shared history, right? How can she do this? I don't get how she can act this way when last year she was all over me. Am I doing something wrong? Help me, Bob. And I replied with, okay, Bob, there's a mistaken line of thinking that I often see, and it kind of goes like this. We were in a relationship for six years, so that should count for something when getting her back. Or, we were together for six years, six years of deep love, I should be able to get her back easily, right? But Bob, I hate to break it to you, but whether you had a six-month relationship, a six-year relationship, or a 26-year relationship with your ex-girlfriend, none of that matters if her heart has hardened for you. All right? Your six years together don't matter because emotions are in the now. Those six years don't count as brownie points because a woman's emotions are in the moment. She felt love for you in the past, but that was only when she said it at that time. In this moment right now, she is completely different than before. Why? Because whether your ex-girlfriend loves you, is excited to talk to you and seems eager to see you, or whether she acts completely cold and wants you out of her life, like she's doing right now, it all comes down to attraction. And she isn't feeling attraction for you right now. Why doesn't she love you anymore? It's simple. Something you did over time ate away at the attraction she had for you. Behaviors you did over time decreased her attraction. How do you get her attraction back? First, realize the mistakes you're doing and fix them. Mistakes like pursuing too much over text, trying to lock a girl into a relationship with you, and agreeing to be just friends after you break up. If you're surprised by this, you'll learn why once you read the 7 Dangerous Mistakes report at xpackebook.com. After you figure out your mistakes, next, you gotta follow the game plan of what you have to do. First, if she says we can still be friends, don't accept. As a man, you have to stand solid and express what you want. And when a woman offers you the consolation prize of let's just be friends, you have to tell her that you're not interested in anything platonic. And then leave the door open by telling her, let me know if you change your mind. After that, walk away and never look back. Now I know this is hard and counterintuitive to getting her back, but it's something you must do. Only when you move on do you actually give her the chance to miss you and want you again. After all, acting weak is what made her lose attraction for you. So you need to start acting strong and surprise her by showing her you're a man. Being firm and direct, walking away and moving on is your first step in that direction. Alright? Next, value yourself. Now think about it. What would James Bond do in this situation? Would he settle for being just friends when he knows he wants more from a girl? Hell no. James wouldn't put up with that. He would move on and find another girl. That's how a man behaves when he values himself. And ironically, this is also the behavior that reattracts an ex-girlfriend back to you. A man who values himself also makes sure he gets educated on how attraction gets created and how it gets destroyed. A big reason men fail with their girlfriends is that they are oblivious to the mistakes they make that push their girlfriends away. And when you have the knowledge of how attraction works and what mistakes to avoid, you become more in control of your relationships and you avoid getting hurt again in the future. This is why you need to read my free training ebook called The 7 Dangerous Mistakes That Stop You From Getting Your Ex-Girlfriend Back. Now it's easy to get the free ebook. Just go to xpackebook.com and enter your email to get it. That's xpackebook.com. And that's all for today. This is Frankie Cola and thanks for watching. Thank you.